Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing well. So I have been into Marshalls and HomeSense a few times since they've opened up and I filmed for you guys and I shared some of the fun things that I saw there and with that a few things did hop into my basket and came home with me. I bought some home decor but they're not in my arms here to hold because they're just big. I bought a long runner for the kitchen back door, a really nice wool rug, well I think it's man-made wool rug and then I don't know I have no idea I'll have to look at the tag and that was $60 and then I bought this gorgeous teak type of bench much larger than the one I had been eyeing at Costco for a while I love it love it love it I love that it has space to store your towels underneath and then the sitting area on the top as well and that's in the spa room downstairs so they're really large and it's kind of hard to share with you in the video so I just filmed some footage and I'll insert into this video and then with that I have a couple little cute items for um, for Easter time that I thought maybe, oh, and I found a couple items on clearance and some things that I wanted to talk about organization for my craft room, or you can use it for your makeup, of course. So I did find some masks, and I've already dug into them because my daughter and I will play with them. These were originally $14.99. They're under, a ton of masks are under, um, the clearance section they are Christmas themed and most of them were Christmas themed but these are just fun and I mean she likes the sequins and stuff so I don't think it really has to be Christmas themed even for um, Valentine's or something I mean it's past Valentine's but who knows what's ha gonna happen next year but I mean red is a nice color for Valentine's as well even if she wants to wear it next year or St. Patrick's coming up now here in March and we've got like a red and a gold they're just cute I mean anytime doesn't have to be Christmas time this can be every day too how pretty is that <laughs> although you'd have to fix this because it's like whoa but yeah they're fun um and we're all wearing masks these days so you can never have too many to keep on hand and for wash actually recently just went into our Dean or our den how do you pronounce the store name is it number one our Dean or number two our den um we went in there and they had their masks all on for one dollar a pack and some of the packs had two masks in them and she got some really cute um not so much glitter but like yeah no she did she got an ombre effect one that's glittery um she got an iridescent one really nice cotton uh, masks and she's switching like every they have to switch like five times she switches at recess and sometimes even while she's at recess. So she's going through masks quite a bit. And I had like maybe 17 for her to start, but I'm finding she needs a little bit more just to keep up and I don't have to keep washing the masks like every other day. Home Sense and Marshalls, because our stores are combined as well here, some of them, have these gorgeous freaking carrots. <laughs> I love them. I just think they're so cute. They look like a corduroy. They are material. They're stuffed. And then there's like like maybe gravel or something do you hear that gravel or something in them and then this is fake like it's got felt tops and then the raffia and green oh that's where you could find some green raffia oh and it's stuffed you can see the stuffing is coming out at the top here a little bit anyways then they wrapped it with some more raffia or you can wrap it with twine love them you can go to walmart if you're a sewer or a crafter um, I'm going to have to cut this off. You can go to Walmart. These are so soft. And find yourself some material because they have nice pieces of material right now. And you can make your own little carrots and just get things like this. But for $7.99, I thought, you know what? By the time I buy the material, if I actually sit down and do it, I made some DIY carrots on the channel last Easter. And I just used newspaper and twine. And they turned out really cute. So they'll go perfect with this. But I couldn't pass up these by the time I buy the material and actually sit down and do them but how freaking like cute are these so now I'm on the hunt for more because I need more carrots all over my house and to go with the carrots I bought this um, I got really lucky so Ray Dunn has this wasn't the one I was actually looking for I'm looking for a different style but Ray Dunn um, oh I don't know if that's coming through on the screen is right there this is $19.99. She's got a line of the Easter goodies. Lots of Easter goodies. And she, I wish that I was a fan. And no offense to those who are. I'm not a fan of the writing here. They're in, it's indented. It's not even something I can really cover up. And I'll just turn my basket this way. And then put my carrots or eggs. I think I'm going to fill one with 
with eggs and one with carrots. I'm gonna go on the hunt for another one. This isn't the style that I'm looking for. Actually, there's another one where she's got an arm like this and it's a little bit wider. It also says Easter or hop hop on it, I think. And I would just turn these facing the wall or if I put them on the fireplace mantle, I will just make sure that the Easter is facing the other way. And I just want to like put a bunch of eggies or carrots in them and look how freaking cute that is. And you know what, this here, I'm, it's pink. It's got a pink bow. I don't know if you can see a pink bow on there. Um, I'm going to switch that out. I think I'm going to just, I don't like the pink. I might just pull it right off. So then it's like nothing's there or I might switch it over to a burlap type material or something soft like a, a cream color burlap type material. So with the egg theme, they had a whole bunch of cute things that kind of went in with this. So there's the egg and this is a light up egg. It actually has the battery compartment on the bottom and this was $29.99. This was probably the most expensive item I actually found and bought. It has detailing like the little, it's the little flowers in the window on the side. It has a little bow at the top, a little de detailing here all around. There's the window again with the little detailing there. There's a bunny and he's holding a little carrot. So super cute, a little basket with the eggs in it a little front door a little window and some more details along the top it was so whimsical looking that it went with all the other things that were there and then i'm like okay i need to have that and i need to have that and the one thing with marshall's own home sense is if you do not buy it when you see it good luck the next time you go back in it will be gone so the thing is Make sure you have your membership with them and you have a 30, well, they have 10 day exchange or return policy, but if you have the TJX membership, then you get 30 days. So 30 days to make a choice if it's the right thing for your home, I think is really reasonable and it gives you some time, like if you're not shopping as often these days to think about it and then go back and return it if you don't want it. So that's the one thing I was like, no, I'm buying them because if I decide not to and then I go back, I will never find them. Look at how freaking, this was $19.99. How cute is this little truck? It's got little eggs in the back. See all the little eggies? It says happy Easter right on this little sign. The bunny. He's a funny little bunny. Like he's smiling. He's a happy little bunny. He's got a little a little birdie on the top of his hat, uh his head. He's got a carrot. And the detailing on the truck is just so done. It's done so beautifully in the little pink bumper. It has little silver sides with yellow lighting. There's flowers all along the, the little truck. The truck has like the little silver handle and a little um, mirror and all little flowers detailing all along the front and even has little chains on the back of his little car like the little card <gasps> the little oh my gosh I'm gonna lose the gnome and anyways he's just so cute and I thought these little whimsical pieces went so perfectly together that I couldn't leave them behind right this is really large it's not even coming through on the screen properly I think there's like you know things that are far away are looking it's like in the rearview mirror the sign this sign things are closer than they appear um, and that is just they're just so cute and these really do match like the little bunnies do match and stuff now this guy doesn't really go with that so we'll see what happens but maybe at the same time he kind of does we'll see um, he's a little gnome he was $14.99 he's got lots of glitter on him he's quite shiny He's holding a little Easter egg. He's holding a bouquet of flowers. He's got little flowers and he's an Easter gnome with little bunny ears. Isn't he freaking cute? And there's his little body very well. You know, he's not, he's ceramic type material. He's not soft. And look at his beard or her, because he's got a little pink hat. I think it's a boy, but you can say whatever you'd like it. And my daughter absolutely loved it. She's like, oh, that's so cute. So we'll see how that goes and how I can stage it. But this pink doesn't really go with that pink, so we'll see what happens there. Other things from Marshalls or HomeSense, the, again, because they're combined, it's kind of hard for me to say, but TJ, they're the TJX stores. I um, posted this in a group because I'm kind of like, I follow the Marshalls and TJX stores on a group. And when I posted that I found these, somebody actually recommended I go on Amazon and that they were less expensive on Amazon. Now, 
they are less expensive expensive on Amazon, but they're not as wide, like deep. So if you're using them for the purposes that I am, um, which is for my craft room, the ones on Amazon are going to be like a, an inch and a bit shorter, so they are not going to benefit me in any way. And I'm glad I did look at the measurements and I did measure these out because I didn't even tell me the measurements on here, but I took a measuring tape and I measured it out. And these are $29.99 each. So this one here has a really deep drawer, the shallow drawer and three shallow drawers. Okay. So this is really wonderful. If you have embossing powders, um, trinkets in little jars, things like that, you can store them all here and you can see them all. The top, I bought two other, well, this one and another one, and I'll share. There are two options here. So this one here was $29.99 as well. And it's three long drawers. So there's this one has this, the two compartments. This one is three long drawers. But again, this I think is seven and a half inches deep. And I'm going to share with you exactly what's happening here because the reason I love them is you can put pens and markers stored in here. So these are my Copics, and I'm going to open one of the drawers here for you guys because that was a key, a key seller for me was the depth. A lot of the Amazon ones, like they are a lot less expensive, but then they're not gonna, and I'm gonna take the Copics out of the packaging, but even with the packaging, they fit. So this is amazing, again, the other ones are much too shallow. They won't fit these things. They probably won't even fit the makeup brushes that I would have because I have really long makeup brushes. But look how beautiful this is. And then you can see all your colors neat and tidy when you have them in your display. You can also remove, they have this sheet here inside. Um, yeah, so it comes with like this little fiber protector thing, but you can remove this if you don't like the look. I like clear looks, I don't like the this sheet so for sure that this is going to be all reorganized also wanted to share with you so there's those two also wanted to share with you from Dollar Tree right um I talk about it quite a bit in my videos shared with you in videos and then you guys never know what I'm talking about so I just grabbed them to share with you these are the rectangular clear organizers that are usually with the makeup little organizers and the ones with the, the cover with the covers that are stackable and the little drawer units that you can glue together and make your own little um, DIY drawers. These are the stackable clear containers that I haven't found in over three years. So if you ever see them, they do stack in to one another. They're deep, so you can see my Copics are in there and they fit nicely. And you can stack these anywhere in your craft room and they're clipped in, oops, they're clipped in and they're not going anywhere. Um, they do not have a lid, so, the next level acts as the lid and I love these and I haven't found them so that's why I bought them I bought these drawer units just because I couldn't find any more of these and these were Dollar Tree item Dollar Tree I haven't found them ever 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 again after I, I purchased those my one of big regret is not having bought more at the time when I saw them they sold so fast and never got restocked one more item I want to share with you is a cute little backpack purse that I bought from I guess yeah Marshalls and I just so I couldn't pass up this bag don't ask me why <clears throat> not that I need another handbag or actually I don't really have any like backpack really I have a bigger backpack um, but not like a handheld kind of one I bought one from Arden or Arden I just heard somebody say Arden and I've been saying Arden my whole life so um, I purchased it and unfortunately I had a feeling that was gonna happen. The backpack is so, so freaking cute. I shared it in a haul, but the zippers like slid right off them. So I have to, like I have to put the zippers back on and then f stitch the ends. Cause like see here at the end here, it doesn't like connect to the backpack itself. So I have to take some time to do that. This backpack is so cute. It's like a purse backpack. It was $49.99, it wasn't on sale at all and it feels nice. It's a little bit shinier than I would have preferred. Like I really do like the Ardeen one that I have because it's not um, shiny. It has an inner pocket and I really like the pattern on the inside. It's really pretty. And it has magnetic, like a magnetic snap. Two zippers so you can like zip all the way to the side if you want. I like having my zippers at the top. And then it has, I've already used it, so that's why I went to go grab it because I had already 
Oh, it has a zipper on the inside. It's made by the company Mystique. And it has a really pretty liner. And it has a zipper area here. And what I love a lot about it is that, you know, in backpacks, like they're a little bit deep and stuff and then you lose things. It actually has a pocket here for your cell phone. And my cell phone fits really nicely. And then my sunglasses as well fit here. So when I'm shopping, I usually have my sunglasses. And look, they just fit right neat and tidy there. And then my wallet and stuff just goes into the into the base. I have my Costco receipt. Just went to Costco. And it's a nice flat base there. And it has, see this part here, like a, an extending part here. It's a really nice backpack slash purse. And I love that it has the... Um, the handle here too so not only is it a bag like doesn't only have the straps here but it has the little thing now the one with Ardeen which I really loved about it was um, however it connected at the top when you put it in on the bottom you can connect everything to one side or the other so when you use it I don't usually use my backpack with two straps on my back I don't know why I just use one and I sling it over my arm so I love that the Ardeen one allowed me to sling it all onto one side so when I was walking around I didn't have like it, it's a little bit different and it's kind of hard for me to explain but they were both gathered together so it felt really nice and secure. This one feels secure too don't get me wrong it's just that I wish I could loop this and clip it onto onto this side and then it would just be all one sided kind of thing. Anyways the buckle uh, the uh, zippers are really pretty too. They're nice and hefty and there's like metal bars on the bottom it's got a gold zipper um and it's not like a a yellowy gold and it's not quite rose gold but it's kind of in between there and one little detail there so anyways that's my marshall's haul i hope you guys enjoyed it i do um plan to visit again because i'm on the hunt for a radon different easter bowl and i'm hoping i find it and then i um, also need to find some more carrots because i want to scatter them through the house until next time everyone i hope you're all doing well thank you so very much for watching bye for now